Ibn Rajab rahimahullah in kalamahu says that we have this fitna. Listen to his point. Some people have been put to trial by those who came later of the later day scholars or the later day mutaakhirin who were connected to knowledge, not necessarily scholars in the true sense of the word. Min kathra kalamuhu because his words are a lot. Wajidalahu and his arguing is a lot and his debating is a lot in the matters of deen. Of deen. So they think because this person talks a lot, debates a lot, argues a lot, is good in argumentation and debate, can talk a long time, that he's the most knowledgeable. Wahada jahal mahd. That is total ignorance. Look to the akabir sahaba. Look to the elders of the companions. Their scholars like Abu Bakr and Umar and Ali and Mu'adh and Mas'ud and Zayd and Thabit. How were they? They talked a little. They talked a little. فَلَيْسَ بِعَالَمِ كَثْرَ تِرِوَايَ The scholars not by relating a lot of narrations. وَلَا بِكَثْرَ تِلْمَقَالَ By speaking a lot. وَلَكِنِهُ النُّورِ But it's a light that Allah throws in the heart of an individual that يَفْهَمْ بِهِ الْعَدْ The servant understands how he can make a distinction between that which is batil, false, and that which is true, and how he can express that to others in a very short and concise and summarized manner. This is knowledge. We're talking